Hello, hey. hello, hello. I need to talk to you. Hello, my friend. How are you? I have a career with yours. Awesome. You're from France, right? Yes, I li I right now I am in France, but I'm not from France. Right now, you know I am. where are you from? Do you know Jean Paul Gaultier? Jean Paul Gaultier, yeah, that's a perfume. Perfume. Yes. Yeah. Where are you from? I am from. Um, my heritage is from like India. Ah, ah India, chicken tikka. The what? Chicken tikka. This is the food. Yeah, in yeah, India. chicken tikka, chicken tikka. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very good food. Very good food. Where, which city do you live in France? I live in Paris. Uh, oh, Paris. And, and uh, we are from Israel. Oh, really? Yes. And what do you, what do you think about the whole situation right now with the with the war? You know, it's not a it's not great situation. We want to fuck the Hamas, you know. Yeah, I, I mean. Ham Hamas is bad for the world. Hamas is the problem, not the Palestinian. Hamas is the problem. Yeah, and do, do you, um, what is, if they take your hostages, what is the best way to get them back? What is your, what is your idea of your solution? You know, it's really, it's really difficult to know because it, we can't just bring the hostages. It, it must to be with, I'm sorry, but it have to be with kill some innocent people, but uh, it's not, I mean, um, wait, um, it's not easy. It's not we don't try to kill people, but if they don't give us the hostages, so we just keep uh, bombing them. But then you're killing Hamas. Those are not innocent people. I'm talking about the innocent people, like when you bomb hospitals and refugee camps. Hey, and hey, Hamas, hey, Hamas. We, we don't bomb hospitals. Never. You know, now the IDF is get into into Gaza. Hamas is um, put trying... with the guns on the, in, the, in the hospital. Yeah, well, they're... they're um... Let me ask you this: What about the the hostages that Israel has from before October seven? We don't have hostages. It's called yes, terrorists. You no, that yes, you do. Yes, they you are do. in prison. You do have hostages. They are in prison. They're in prison no, for, for doing nothing. For just they're, they're they're little kids. I've I've seen the reports. We don't take little kids as hostages. We're yes. not Hamas. <laughs> you do, bro. All right. Let me ask you another thing. Let me ask you another thing. What, what do they teach you on school about Arabs and Palestinians growing up? What do they teach you? If Palestinians mm -hmm. want peace, we want peace. Of course. But what we learn about school? Yeah, if, if uh, I agree. If, if uh, everybody should be peaceful, that's the best way. Yes, you know, I'm not uh, talking English really good, but I will try to explain you that, I mean, there is a place here that called Judea and they almost all almost of the time there was here Jews and Arabs together in peace most of the time no in peace but together live oh. here yeah most of the time it was peace before 1948 it was mostly peaceful no you know before 1948 it was programs that the Arabs trying to kill our our people here there were programs yes programs what do you mean by programs like the arabs just get into our a uh, kibbutzim you know what kibbutz Ki kibbutz is like houses kibbutz it's like a town town little town, town. okay okay so they get into our little little towns and they start to kill a uh, uh, jewish the Arabs. And and do you have like evidence of that? Like, can I search that online? No, it's like, you know, uh, Jews are were living a lot of the time in Europe, and then the Nazis are come, I came, and then there are in a, in Israel. Uh, a little bit Jews, Arabs, 
and the British uh, mandate. Yeah, the British mandate. This is what control here, the British mandate. And it was uh, Arabs and Jews. The Arabs, uh, they don't call it Palestine, it's just Arabs. The Palestinians, is it's like a, something they... Uh, it, it, it was invent. just a land. It was just a land. It wasn't an official country. It was just a land. No, it's like was a territorial land. Pal who called Palestina, and Palestina it's come from the name of something in the Jewish Bible who lived in in here, the Plish team. It's called. Okay, and can, can you talk to me more about the Jewish Bible? Is it the Torah? The Torah is it called Torah? Yes, the Torah, Torah, Torah. Can you can you um, tell me more about the Torah? Like what what does it say? Uh, in which I mean, like what what's the main uh, message of the Torah? What is the main message? You know, I'm not a big uh, learning of the Torah. I mean, just in school and in school, it's not really a, a professional, so I can't tell you exactly. Okay, and I know the basic. I know the basic. Okay, and do you believe in God? Yes. Yes. We have a keeper. We have a keeper. Yeah, I mean, yeah, but a, a keeper. I mean, I can, I can wear, I can wear a phone on my head, and and that doesn't make me believe in God. <laughs> that has nothing to but do. Keeper is something that no Jews. Keeper, it's, it's a. It's yeah, it's It's like a. I don't know what to say. That that's okay. And do you do you believe you are God's chosen people? Mama, mama. You know. Yes, yes. No, it's a little bit. How do you say it? If 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 a control here the um, a lot of uh, a lot of empires like uh, the romans the greeks the the ottomans a lot Ottoman. Ottoman. Ottomans, yes. a lot a lot of people the nazis not control here control in europe but all of them try to kill us. to kill us and god save us all the time that's we why we are here in the uh, the promised land no that's we that's why we are still here so because god save us you know there there was a lot of a lot of uh, people that they uh, trying to destroy a uh, jewish the nazis the utmans the a lot a lot no, through the history yeah but i know i know the nazis wanted to destroy the jewish people and that's why you came to palestine and then palestine accepted the jewish people also i know that the ottomans uh, sorry the romans expelled the jews from uh jerusalem and then it was the ottomans that allowed the jews back into jerusalem so i don't know why you're saying that the ottomans wanted to kill the jews uh, I don't know if the Ottomans trying to kill the Jews, but uh, you know when the the Torah has made. Uh, yeah, by the times of Moses. Five thousand years ago, when the North Northrian Christian uh, Bible has made. Christian Bible like two thousand years ago. Okay, in the Torah, five thousand. We were three thousand year before, yeah, and before, the Jewish. And, and before you, there were other people as well there. Yeah, I believe yes. So that people that were before you can come in now and say that this land belongs to them because they were there before you. No, but no? It, we talk about a really, really old, old times. Yeah, but you. I don't like. You're applying that logic to the Palestinians. You're saying that because you were there before them, you get to that, get that land. But if the Canaanites come and say that they were there before you, they get to apply the same logic, right? I don't know, you know, but 
אין דה... איך אומרים המנון? תביאי לבדוק. תביאי לבדוק, תפתח את הטלפון. וויט? What is called the thing for the land? How it's called? The what? The song is the land. Song land. I don't know what you mean. You know what's the tikva? You mean from the river to the sea? That one? No, no, not, not this, not this. Give me this. Human. Human. Wait, wait a minute. Sure. Awesome. Yo! You know what is an, an anthem? Anthem. Anthem. National anthem. Yes, this. Yes. yes. So, in the national anthem Call of Israel, in, of Israel, <laughs> Uh, there is a sentences there that we must to be in Israel okay. and it it was written like a lot of years ago yeah you can you can be in Israel not nobody's denying you that but the what the world is is angry at is the killing of innocent civilians that's what the world is angry at nobody's prohibiting you from living there but just okay to, Yeah. Okay, okay. But, uh, what I really... You know, there is a lot of fake news about we killing children and all this, and that's why Hamas attacked us on 7 of October, but it's not true. We're not killing children for our, for our fun and killing civilians for our fun. But I, I have seen videos of the IDF killing and then celebrating So you, how, how can you deny that? I've seen too much evidence. No, fake news. No, fake news. No, it's fake not, news. It's We not. are the most... Okay, okay. If, if, if it's fake news, then why is South Africa suing you on the International Court for Genocide? Antisemitism. Antisemitism. Antisemitism? Yes. But do you know that the Palestinians are also Semites? So saying anti-Semitism is also anti-Palestinian because they are Semites. No, I know, I know, but when, when I uh, say anti-Semitism, it's hating Jews. We are the most uh, army morality. Morality. Where's the most morality army? The most moral army in the world. Uh, where have I heard that before? All right. So if you say it's anti-Jews, 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 it should be called anti-Judaism. Like, or is, do you know how when you go against Islam, it's called Islamophobia? Then uh, Ju Judaism should be Judaism phobia. When you say anti- We don't, we, yeah. at, at the bottom, at the bottom of the, of the, of the, of the line, at the bottom of the line, We don't, we don't have a, another land. We don't have. The, the Israel is the... the... The only country... Is uh, for Jews. But there's no country that is only for a religion. Like, uh, you can go to, for example, India. You will find uh, that it's a Hindu country, but there also lives Muslims. So it, it's a democratic country. There, there's no country that is only a single religion. You cannot say that a, a, a country is only for Jews. That doesn't exist. I hope you understand. I hope you understand me. Yeah, yeah. Yes, you know. I can't. It's hard to talk when it's hard to talk when we don't speak the same language. No, I, I, I'm not, I'm not explaining this really good in English because I'm, I'm not really good at English. But you can. find in the internet a lot of people explain about it and it's it sounds really really no no not really bad not really bad uh, no really bad it's really, really good it's, it sounds really religion <laughs> anyway okay, example I'll... I'll, I'll leave you this name on the chat, Norman Flinkenstein. He's Jewish. He's Jewish and he is a historian 
his fathers were killed in the in by the Nazis. His fathers were killed okay. in the Nazis, so he knows a lot about the whole history. Maybe you can you can you know him. my my grand my grand uh, father and his grand and his grandfather were killed by the Nazis too. Oh, were killed by the Nazis. Yes. All all of our fathers were killed by the Nazis. So okay, let me ask you this. Um, I mean, it's, it's very sad. I'm I'm really. I we, nobody wants another event like the Holocaust to ever happen again. But unfortunately, something very similar is happening right now in Gaza. Um, let Let me ask you this. Um, I'm really, I'm I'm really can can understand what what you are talking can about. But it's not it's not the same. It's really not the same. The it's idea worse. is not trying to. In. You know what is IDF? Yeah, Israel diaper. Israel, Israel defense, defense. Oh, we defense. are not okay. attacking. We only defense. If you see all the all the wars that starts, they they starts because of the Arabs, uh, Egypt, Syria, Lebanon. They always started the war. We are just won them. Okay, um, I mean, you, you guys win because you have um, a sugar daddy paying for all the, the military equipment and all the bombs and all that stuff. Right? America! America! <laughs> but America. we also have a strong military because the people in Israel know that if they don't give their heart for the military, there is no be Israel. So everyone wants to, to be in the military and I'm in two years going to be in the military and this is how it's going to be. And and then you're gonna kill Palestinians? No, 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 no. Palestinians, terrorists. Terrorists, but how how can you tell who's terrorist and who's not? Who's want to kill? Someone us? wants who to kill me. Who I will, uh, hurt uh, the Jews people. You know that there is a a rule in the in the IDF that you can't shoot a terrorist if he come to shoot you. You only can uh, shoot his leg, not to kill him, yes. not but to the, kill him, because if the if the soldier will kill him, he will get into the jail. Yeah, I've uh, I've also seen the chief rabbi of the military say that you must kill babies because when they grow up, they can become terrorists. So it gives you the permission to kill okay. them when they're babies. Okay. Is that I true or not? Him, but what what he mean? What he means that, what he means that the... Wait, what, what they learning at school, the Palestinians, what they learning at school, it's to kill Jews, yes. to, to murder Jews, yes. to rape, to There's rape no the women. There's no proof of that. There's no proof of that. There is, there is a there Palestinian. Is a video. Wait, there Show is me. a Palestinian. Show me a link. Who? I... I, like Wait, like I send you I send you the name of a guy. Sh send me something that I can I can have a, as evidence. Okay, so so that so that logic so that logic that you're saying. So so yeah, that logic that you're saying about the kids becoming terrorists in the future can be applied to any kid. You can have a kid tomorrow, and and somebody can say, hey, let's kill him because in the future he's gonna no, be a terrorist. But they learn at school to hate Jews. They learn it at school. We don't learn no, at school to hate, no, to bro, hate they Palestinians. Don't. They don't. They don't. That's what they teach there you is, that they do, but they don't. They the Palis There is a Palestinian who moved to Israel. Okay. Look. Who be he became he became to to be Jewish. Okay, and he tell that. All what they're learning at school is to hate Jews. Who? The guy named Doron? Uh, I think. <laughs> okay. I All don't know what he called. I don't look, know what he called. This is what a um, uh, Palestinian uh, child is uh, learning uh, in school. This is a Israeli soldier and this is a Palestinian soldier. This is a show in the school. Ah, wait. <laughs> Okay. 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 Okay.
لا بل لا لا مبينا نغوي احنا قاعدين من قوم باليهود عشان نرجع لهم لا مبينا نغوي 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 لا a martyr someone who killed jews someone who killed jews and when he go to the ganeden uh, paradise and, I... and when he go to paradise he get 72 uh, virgins no bro that's not true that's no, not true this is this is what the palestinians believe yes no, this that's is what, not they, what believe. they believe bro that's not what they believe you want to leave the time she kill me then hey wait wait okay i'm, I'm trying to do you do okay, you know if, do you know if, if you understand something of this so look at this okay if you understand something i don't know if you understand <laughs> it's, i don't i don't know hebrew <laughs> okay let me let me let me let me explain you something from from what i understand <laughs> For how, okay, let's say let's say you are eight years of old. Let's say, for example, you're eight years, okay, and somebody yes. comes in and unalives your mom and your dad and your family, and you you survive, right? When you grow up, you're gonna grow up with vengeance. You're gonna wanna uh, unalive the people that unalive your parents. So that no, this is what that's what's this happening. This is what there. happens in the seventh of October. That's what's happening there. Like when you unalive children's parents, they're gonna grow up to be a resistance force. Do you but understand? We don't try na. We don't try na kill civilians. Look, we, we really don't kid, try. This kid said, "They go, he said he believes in taking the Jews and taking the Jews." This kid. In Palestine, okay. Said. I believe to. Uh, I believe in. Uh, in Jews. Uh, they just. They say it on the. On this, but I don't know if you understand it because it, it's in Arabic and Hebrew. So I don't know if you understand. No, it. I don't. I don't speak Arabic and I don't speak Hebrew. But I let, okay. Let me let me let me ask you this. Um, one moment. תגיד לו שזה מישהו שאמר שהוא סופורט בכל מי שרוצה להרוג אותנו. Do you know, do you know who is this old man? Yes. David Ben Gurion. Yeah, okay, let me read, let me, let me read what he said, and then you give me your opinion, okay? He said, we must use terror, assassination, and intimidation. We must steal, the, steal their land and eliminate uh -huh. every uh -huh. social service to free Israel from Arab population. That's what he said. It's right there on his autobi on his biography. Where where do you where do you read it? From which website? Um, the source is a biography by Michael Ben Sohar. It's a it's it's an authentic biography written about him that's the speech he gave to the israeli soldiers that we must we must use, use terror and wait we must steal their land it's not true the source is right there the last phrase it says a uh, biography by michael ben zohar you see wait i i'm looking for michael ben zohar i will tell you who is it
que güey. Let me let me ask you another thing. Do you, do you know that that Israel is prohibiting food from entering into Gaza? Don't you think that that's going to kill your hostages? If what? Like they're, they're not allowing food to go in. So isn't that going to kill your hostages? <coughs> we just don't trust them. If we bring them food, how are we are supposed to know that they bring it to the hostages? But if you don't bring food at all, you by 100% sure that your hostages are not getting food. But all the other countries are giving food. America's giving food. Uh, I don't know who else, but there is countries that are giving food. We don't, we don't need to, to, to worry, to worry for them. They want to kill us. They want to kill us every moment. All right, Bo. I, I guess we can go in circles and circles about who started it. It, it doesn't matter. It, 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 like, it's so sad. Like, my whole, the whole world is really sad right now. It's too much civilians ki killed right now. Yes, it's too much. And like, I really try to explain you that the IDF really don't uh, want to kill anyone. Didn't don't want to kill any anyone of the civilians we just want to hurt the, the hamas and there is okay you know there is people in israel that called smolani you know what is it no it's a it's politics that he really wants land of palestine let, let, let me ask you your opinion on this when you read a headline like this what do you think israel bulldozers run over Pregnant woman in labor in Gaza. So, okay. so, so the woman was pregnant. She had a baby in her stomach and a bulldozer ran over her. What do you think about that? It's an, it's an, this is, yeah, it's not true. I'm, I'm willing. No, there's no, images I, and there's videos. How can it not, it not be true? Show me the video. I really want to look, look can, at it. I, there's many videos. There's many videos. All the world are against us. It's no matter how they trying to hurt us. Mm, I don't know. All the world is against us. All of them. What? what they what, will try to. What? What do you think about this guy? You, you see what Robbie it says? In war time, rape. He's this is. He's this, saying that raping is okay in war. That's what he's saying. What do you think about that? If you don't, if you don't live here, you don't understand that. Yes, but because you don't live is, in Gaza, is, you don't understand. You don't live in Gaza, you don't understand. You, I live in Israel. I live in but Israel. But you don't live in Gaza. You don't know what's going on in there. You, you well, only know what what your government shows you. Show me, show me the news. Show me the news in your country. This is what is going on where I live. This, this. This is I. My phone uh, is a uh, film that. Film. Wait, you see the bombs? No, I, I couldn't see anything. Show me the From game. Syria. This is I filmed with my phone. Eh, you, Ani, me. He. Yeah, and, and you say those are bombs from where? Syria. Syria. So why is the people from Gaza. Uh, I'm sorry, Lebanon, price. Lebanon, Lebanon, Lebanon. Oh, sorry, okay, Lebanon. now it's Lebanon. So why, why is, why is the people in Gaza paying for that? No, the people in Gaza paying for what they did in the 7th of October, you know, until the 7th of October, it was a, uh, you know, a little bit uh, terrorist come to Israel and kill some people between the years, this, this, but now they just uh, move the line. I would say. Okay. Can I can I show you? Can I show you a little small video about? Um, let me let me see if I can find it. I'm trying to find it. Um, what do you what do you think? What do you think when you see things like this? What do you, what do you think about this? 
man this is not true at all man bro how is that not true like there's it's not true they, they are on tiktok they're on tiktok doing the dances man, and doing all this true. stuff how man, is that not I true i swear to god it's not true man how is that not it's true fake. it's all fake news it's not true what it's not the happening heck? it's not happening man i i think i I'm, think you're really, you're I, too small to to know that that is no uh, no i really I really, if it was true, I, I was with you and, and yes, but it's not true. It's really, really not true. We don't want to rape the women and we don't want to kill civilians. We just want to uh, Hamas to dead. Okay. Um, let me see. Let me see. Thank, thank you so much for talking to me because normally people get annoyed and they skip, but you guys at least have been able to not skip and have a conversation. So I respect I that. I respect that. There is a lot of people that the the news are are eating them uh, fake uh, fake things. But that is not fake. I showed you a, a real. Uh, that's okay. Let me let me show you this one. What do you, what do you think about this? That's the IDF hitting worshippers inside Al Aqsa Mosque. What do you think about that? Uh, this is what they I did in Ramadan last year, the IDF. They entered Al-Aqsa Mosque and they start hitting the worshippers in Al-Aqsa. You know what's happening? Uh, our wait, holidays, wait, 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 it's because all over the Ramadan, I don't know if, the, if you know, the Ramadan is the, the time in the year that there is much, much terrorists that came to Israel and just doing uh, uh, things, uh, killing his, uh, our people. <laughs> no, bro. Ramadan is a month of peace where you don't eat no, and you dedicate no, it to for God. Them, for them, Ramadan, it's the most uh, the most time that the terrorists come to Israel. Okay, but if you Google what is Ramadan, what comes up? No, of course, it's it's uh, it's the Muslims uh, did holiday and this, but I said, when the Ramadan starts, the the IDF is really want to be want to be strong because there is a lot a lot of uh, terrorism. Yeah, I understand that if that's your point of view, but that doesn't explain why they're hitting people inside the mosque praying. That's not terrorist. The terrorism is what the IDF is doing by hitting the worshippers. I don't know. I don't know if the video is true. <laughs> what the heck? Oh my goodness! This is the problem, bro. This is the problem. No, you know, maybe maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, but this is I, fact. This is fact. This is yes. not invented. This is fact. I show you the video. I show you the. Okay, let me let me let me see if I can show you. Um, show me another video. I really I really. Okay, want I'll, to show know. You, maybe, I'll, I'll show maybe you. Maybe my country. Maybe one country is like for lie to me i don't know they, they do i'll show you a video of a jewish person of a jewish person speaking okay so that is jewish to jewish okay let me let me let me quickly look at it okay here 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 i got it i got it look look i'm gonna put it okay okay One minute, it's only one minute. Or, or dismissing us entirely. Um, the fact that we are um, a whole range of 13 different Jewish organizations. And trust me, we have different views. We really, we really do. And that's wonderful. But the fact that we can all come together and understand that this is so vitally important to campaign as a Jewish blog is, is being really inspiring. And it's an entirely 
Oh, yeah. um, um, guide the way across the world. We're making our voices heard. None of us are free until we are all free. That's cool. Uh, this is our fight too. This is this is our fight. See, those are all okay. Jewish so, people. I really know what is it. I really know what is it. She's Jewish, right? She and all the people on the parade were Jewish. <laughs> Oh, you saw what she wear? Yeah, she had the Palestinian thingy. Yeah, yeah, and uh, rings of uh, watermelon. It means Palestine, right? Yes, it means free Palestine, yeah. Okay, so this is the type of people in Israel that want to, to really have a, a Palestinian state with a, a Israel, a Jewish state, okay? Together. It's called Smolani, and it's like... It's there is in Israel the the people in Israel are really someone think like that, someone think like that. Someone think we need to destroy Palestine and we need to that's all land be us because because we can't uh, trust them and can't live with them in peace. And some of them say we can't live with them peace and it's not good what there is people in Israel that say free Palestine. You understand it? Yeah. So what 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 do you think should be the solution? Uh, I don't think we can trust them. I really I really tell you the truth. No, but no, but what I mean is like, do you agree I mean, with with a two state solution? Do, do you do you want to consider Palestine as a country or as a state, or or you want to consider only one single state called Israel? Okay, I want. We want to, there is a state. state to the Palestinian but Hamas, and state Hamas, with the, uh, to Israel. But Hamas don't control the Palestinian state. But in peace, peace, peace. We don't, we just want peace. Okay, so you, you propose two state solution. You propose a Palestinian state and a Israel state, right? Yes. Yeah, I, I mean, to, we I mean, live together, together. Yes, yes. Palestinian and Israel, but in okay. peace. Okay, in now, peace, really that's, with peace that's, and, that's also wait, what, what I, I want. Trying to say, that's what, also what, what I, I want. Trying, what I'm trying to tell you, that the people in Israel are really divided right now. Yeah. So, you know what's divided? So, so yeah, like you say, you want a Palestinian state, you want a two-state solution, right? But your, your prime minister, uh, Setanyahu, he said that he does not want a Palestinian state. He clearly says he does not want a Palestinian state. And this is because we are really, really afraid of them to, to come and do, because they hate us too. They really hate us. They are not so innocent as you think. I'm really trying to explain no, to you. I'm not saying Hamas is innocent. Hamas is, they, what they did no, on October 7th is bad. It's there terrorism. There are people, there are kids in there. What, what do you think that Hamas is a, Hamas is controlled there in everything, in their, in their schools, they con they just control it, and they learn kids to hate Jews. Okay, um, there's a video I also have about uh, a Jewish a Jewish school where they hate, where they teach to hate the Arabs. Do they teach you in school to hate Arabs? There is no something like that. There is, I mean. There is no something clearly like that. It's Can like I show to... you? Can I show you that video? Yes, show me. Okay, let me look for it. Give me one minute to look for it, please. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's not fake, bro. It's not fake. I swear. It's from a school in in, in Israel. I just okay. Let me, let me just find. I, it. Let me I, just find it. I will say if I, if it's cool for me, like if it's yes. So yeah, if you think I, it's fake, you can say it's fake. That's fine. But I just wanted you to tell me your opinion, right? Yes. I, I, let me just quickly try to find it, please. For one moment. You know there is also, I mean, uh, people in Israel that that can can explain you can explain you better than me because I'm also don't speak English really really good and I also. I'm just a child. I can give you people no. who know better than me about no, this. But you do. You you speak well. You speak well. But you, I understand everything you said. 
You okay. speak very well. I have no problem with, with the English. I'm just trying to find the video, but it's hard to find. Um, okay, I found another one uh, that I can show you in the meantime. Um, this is not the school one, but it's still, I also want your opinion on, on this one. So he, here it is. Have you seen this one? Okay, okay, I, I understand the, the point, I understand the point. So they say kill all Arabs. <laughs> Do you agree with that? Okay, so this is, you know, the, the, the Israelis, I say you again, they are really divide. There is people who think really, really uh, extreme to this and really extreme to this. Yeah, you seem like a good really, guy. Really, really. You seem like a good guy. No, I just wanna. I I feel like I can't I can't live with them in the same land because I I really don't trust them. But I really trying to to understand why why all this happened. Okay, <laughs> now now uh, I found the one from the Jewish school. Now you tell you me. You see all of this? You see all of this? This message? Yeah. What is that? This is a message that that uh, bombs in Israel. From Lebanon. Yes, but, yes. but the, the only information you're getting is from your government. Try to search outside your government. Um, so, you, so you get this is many, false. many sources. No, this no, is... I'm, a, I'm this not is... saying it's false. I'm not saying it's false. I'm just saying that you only get fed by what you say with your government. See, here, here's the school video. Here, here. You tell me if wait, this is a school. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I, I will come back. Okay. I hope these guys don't disconnect because I really want to show them the school video and I, I want them to explain because these guys look like nice people that you can dialogue with Okay, show me the video. Okay. This does this look like a Israeli school? Now let me play it. Let me play it. Okay, okay, I get the point, I get the point. Almost over, almost. Wait, I, I have something to, to say about it. So, so, on this video, it seems like they're teaching them to destroy Alexa Mosque. And no, wait, wait, we are, wait, wait, we are wait, no, wait. there are, there are, people, there are Israel. religions, people, and the people in Israel, like me, that I'm no religion, I'm not, I'm not loving them, not everyone loves them. Okay, so there's like, there is, different. we believe that what we need to do there is are just, belief, um, there are learn Torah, not, not just, the army, not to work, just learn Torah. All day. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll read a little bit more about the Torah. Um, yes. It, it will be nice if you can also read a little bit of the Quran um, and, and see that it's really not 
bad or terrorist like they say it is. We are, don't have a, a, any problem with Muslim people. I mean, but, it, it, but the videos they say dead to Arabs and Arabs are not Muslims. There's Muslims from Indonesia. But Indonesia this is the extreme. And... This is the extreme people of Israel. Not yes, everyone yes. is like one of the uh, some of the. Uh, I mean, uh, this is like like uh, me and the, like you. There is a people who very support Palestine, and there is a people. Who? Atamarta ani vata. Amarti, she there is a people. Who very support Palestine, okay? Very, very, very. In Israel, inside Israel. Yes. Okay. But you, you, may, is, we can talk there, uh, with you. There are extreme people in Israel who just want to kill the Arabs, uh, don't want to be peaceful with them, and only a, only a Jew, Jewish uh, state. And I, and most of the people in, in Israel are like me, are like, we don't need to kill all all of them. No, I mean not all of them are bad. No, I understand and I appreciate I appreciate you because you're a good person and um, the problem is that these extremist people that you're talking about that are in, in Israel when they get to the government and they are all in the government positions and they control the army and control who to kill and who not and what narrative to feed you and what news to feed you then it becomes a problem. You understand? It's the same. Yes. It's the same thing as Hamas. Is if Hamas you know. controls the what it's fed to the people over there, it's the same problem. You understand? So mm -hmm. it's totally Israel is a really, really. A, she's not really understanding state. You understand what I mean? The government. They are not really understanding. There is people like that. There is people like that. Uh, in two thousand, you know what happens in two thousand five. Um. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, there's so many things have happened. Can you remind me? Uh, there was like a massacre let, or something. Let Let me remind you. There. Uh, they left Gaza uh, or something. People in Gaza and people in uh, Israel live together, together, really, really together, and and the and the Palestinians are uh, go a. Uh, Go to the city of Israel in Gaza. I mean, in the in the place in Gaza, it was Jews and, Ar and Arabs together. Okay, in 2005, and then just because uh, it can, we can't uh, <laughs> live with them in peaceful, and the government in Israel are really afraid of uh, Palestinians to attack uh, Jewish people. So we just all the. Israel government, get out from the Gaza Strip, okay? Get out, and Hamas control it. From 2005 until now, Hamas, 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 only Hamas. But do you know that uh, Netanyahu himself has said that they sponsor Hamas so that the POL cannot come into power because the POL wants a two-state solution? And Netanyahu only wants, uh, he wants to conquer the whole thing. So he needs Hamas. Hamas is working for Netanyahu. Do you understand? It's not, Hamas is not for Netanyahu. No, uh, not right now, but it was sponsored by Netanyahu to create division in the Palestinian land. No, man. Okay, let me let me maybe, put it the maybe other. I maybe I'm not understanding you right because Yeah, maybe I'm not saying uh, it right. Let's put it another way. Let's put it another way. Hamas okay. won the elections in 2005, let's say, right? So or, or whenever they came into power, that it's time period is already over. Ah, Gaza, I like Ben Shapiro. Okay. Gaza should have new elections so that people can elect a new party. But they are not being able to elect another party because they're not being able to let have an, an election. That's the problem. Okay, let me ask you another thing. Why does Israel control the water, the food, the electricity from Gaza? Why they don't have their own I, I, rights? You wanna, you wanna that I tell you the truth? Yeah. They are too stupid to control it. Hamas <laughs> oh, will talk all. Hamas would talk all, I'm really sorry, but the Palestinian people 
they they are doing kids with their cousins. They are stupid. They I'm really sorry, but they are stupid. I mean, um, I don't know about that, but you know this guy. You know this guy. Hi, Israel is justified in killing civilians because of the acts of terror committed by Hamas. Why is it Hamas justified in doing what it did? Because Israel is keeping thirteen thousand children. It has tried them in military courts. Since the establishment of Israel, 55,000 Palestinian homes have been bulldozed. So wow. why isn't Hamas justified in doing what it did if we use your logic? Um, well, so I'm going to answer your question, and then I'm going to ask you a question if you don't mind. Is that right? So the the so my answer is that Israel would not be justified in killing Palestinian civilians because of the actions of terrorists. Israel would be justified in attempting to kill terrorists, and civilian casualties are a cost of war. That is just a reality of life. During World War II, there were 70,000 Brits who died during the Blitz bombing, and there were two million Germans who died, no. civilians who died during World War II. And I don't see a lot of monuments in Britain because of the two million civilians who died in Germany. The costs of war are brutal. They're terrible. They're horrifying. There's a vast difference in moral scope between deliberately going into a civilian area and murdering everyone you can find and trying to kill a terrorist. Who is okay, so it's basically it's it, Ben Shapiro. It just, it, Yes, explains really good what happens here. Yeah, okay, now, let me ask you this. Um, if a Hamas person kidnaps somebody and they are in a hospital in Israel, say, say they kidnap your mom, for example, and they take her to a hospital in Israel, are you going to bomb the whole hospital? Wait, uh, ask again. Okay, say, say somebody kidnaps your family member and they take them to a house whatever house it is and instead of you sending soldiers to rescue your family members what you do is you just bomb the house you just bomb the house because you want to kill the the, the terrorists is that fair because that's what no, the idf is doing no because the idf can't can know can't know where the hostages are they can they can't know they know they don't know they, they don't do know, know. i they, can i can prove it they... i can prove it to you i can prove it okay. to you okay let me show you now another video oh man these guys <laughs> left no. these guys left Ah, oh. hi. Bye. What? Free Palestine. Free Palestine. Free Palestine. Free Palestine. Free Palestine. 